Well guys, the long wait is over as it's now time for week one of the 2021 DCFL season. It's I'm so looking forward to this being back after over a year since we last done it. I'm going to try and get this done as quickly as possible. That way we can get to 2022 while we're still in 2022. So anyways, of course, here is the current schedule for 2021 since we have no division set. I mean, I'm, I'm standing set yet. So, with that out of the way, let's now get into the week one action. As it's going to be starting off with my Baltimore Charm at the defending three-time champion Indiana um, Indianapolis Rabbit Stallions. Then it would be the Boston Pay um, yeah, Boston Red Jackets at the Jacksonville Scouts. And then it would wrap up at the Eastern Conference with the New York Gangsters at the Philadelphia Sonics. Then we get to the Western Conference where it's off with the Chicago Staleys at the Kansas City Arrowheads. Then the San Diego Mean Green Machines visiting the Oakland Pillagers. And we wrap it up with the Seattle Tenyo at the new team, the Tacoma Slashers. An outer City matchup too right there. So now let's get into the week one results. And here they are as we start off with the Baltimore at Indianapolis. As ba Indianapolis won it 38-24, although the game was very close into the into the deep into the third quarter as the game was tied up at 24 as the charm were really putting up a fight but indianapolis ran away with it into the fourth quarter winning at 38 to 24 i'm still proud my team put up a good fight though instead of it being a blowout then the boston red jackets at the indianapolis scouts as the scouts were actually you know um, red jackets were leading 14 10 going into the third quarter it looked like they might pull off an upset before jacksonville blew up with 20 points in the fourth quarter to win it 30 to 20, I mean 30 to 14, and then the New York, New York Gangsters were at the Philadelphia Sonics as the game was a low-scoring affair as the um, New York Gangsters ended up winning it 12-10 with the only win being off of safety as Philadelphia put up a really strong defensive effort as they're um they stopped New York really big time but their offense showed up I mean did not show up whatsoever. When they needed to, because they had multiple times they could have won it on the final few drives, but they got stopped. Meanwhile, in the Western Conference, the Chicago Staleys were at the Arrow I mean, City Arrowheads, and the Arrowheads stunned Chicago as they won it 16 to three. They were up 16 nuff at one point as Chicago's offense just could not get anything going. A dominant performance by the Arrowheads are now one and zero, as the Chicago Staleys already matched their loss total from last year. And then the, Oak, the um, San Diego Mean Green Machines were at the um, Oakland Pillagers. San, Oakland went up 14 nothing quickly. San Diego started the rally and came back and actually got 11 points in the fourth quarter to tie it up at 24 to force overtime. San Diego wanted to start the for, overtime off, but they went three and out. So then Oakland got the ball. They went downfield and got the game-winning field goal to win it 27-24 as they're 1-0 as San Diego's 0-1. Meanwhile, to wrap it up, the San Diego Tenyo... We're at the Seattle, um, Tacoma Slashers, their first game ever, and Seattle went off on them offensively, winning it 33 to 20. The first time Seattle's offense looked so good in a long time, as they put up 33 points. Seattle, um, Tacoma made it a little bit more respectful at the end of the game, scoring 10 um, mercy points to make the score a little bit better. But Seattle dominated Tacoma 33 to 20. So as we take a look at the current Week One stands now, so in the Eastern Conference, Indianapolis leads. And then second place is Jacksonville, and third is New York as they're the top three teams in the playoffs. After that, it's, the, it's um, Philadelphia fourth seed, then the Boston Red Jackets the fifth seed, as my charmer last place in the sixth seed. Meanwhile, in the Western Conference, the Kansas City Arrowheads have the lead over the Seattle Tenyo by a coin toss, as they're number one seed, the Seattle's number two, and Oakland's number three, as they're the three teams in the playoffs right now. As San Diego is the fourth seed, and then Chicago has a tiebreaker over Tacoma by the coin toss as well. They have the fifth seed as Tacoma's the sixth seed. So if the season ended today, it would be New York at Jacksonville with the winner heading to Indianapolis, and the Western Conference would be Oakland at Seattle with the winner heading to Kansas City. And we're going to quickly look at the Week 2 schedule now, as it'll start off with my 0-1 charm hosting the 1-0 Oakland Pillagers. Then it'll be the 1-0 Indianapolis Rabbit Stallions visiting the 0-1 San Diego Mean Green Machines. Then the 1-0 Jacksonville Scouts visiting the Chicago Staleys at 0-1. Then 
Then it'll be the New York Gangsters 1-0 hosting the Tacoma Slash at 0-1. Then it'll be the Boston Red Jackets 0-1 at the Kansas City Arrowheads. They'll host the Kansas City Arrowheads at 1-0. And then it'll be the Philadelphia Sonics 0-1 at the Seattle Tenya 1-0. So there's no um, games right now where it's two 1-0 teams going at. It's possible we can have all six teams that are undefeated stay undefeated and all six teams winless stay winless. Alright, so week one's in the books. We'll see you guys soon for week two as we hope to get this season going really soon. See you guys then. And what a season that we hope to get this time.